A single shot of a new mRNA vaccine did a good job protecting animals against all known flu viruses. It's research that could help prevent the next pandemic. Our vaccine induces broad immunity against all of the diverse influenza subtypes that we may encounter in the future. University of Pennsylvania researchers have just published their findings. Using mRNA technology, the experimental shot used antigens or immune targets for 20 flu viruses. Early data shows the vaccine elicited high levels of antibodies in mice and ferrets to all 20. The major advance is this multivalent uh, capacity of it, where we can, we don't have to just limit it ourselves to have one vaccine antigen or two vaccine antigens, we have 20 vaccine antigens. That's important because all vaccines work by offering our immune system a sneak peek at potential invaders so it knows what to attack. Traditional flu vaccines do that by slowly growing, extracting and injecting up to four weakened strains of the virus. mRNA vaccines don't require all that labor. They offer a set of genetic instructions that allow our body to make tiny pieces of the virus. It is a, a significant paper uh, in the, the field, not only of influenza vaccination. Canadian experts say there's a lot we still need to learn, but mRNA vaccines hold incredible promise. It's a huge contribution to really get this universal concept from the lab and preclinical studies in animals with a real door open to clinical application. American researchers say they're now setting up human trials for the universal mRNA flu vaccine to ensure it's safe and effective in people. But without the funding or urgency of a pandemic, testing and regulatory approvals will likely take years. Christine Birak, CBC News, Toronto.